Just five days until the start of All-Star Week in North Wilkesboro. Lots of people are excited mm -hmm. for Wilkes County to be back on the national stage. The pride in Wilkesboro is building as the day gets closer. WFNY News 2's Jalen Gilkey talked to local businesses that say the return of racing is bringing new life to the community. The countdown to the 2023 All-Star Race is underway. You know, like I said, everything's been going away for the last several years, so just bringing something back is just a huge plus. Many of the business owners in downtown North Wilkesboro are ready for NASCAR's comeback. Good to see you. I remember back in uh, grade school, we used to get out of school to go watch qualifying. So that's been, I think the last race over here was 1996. Everybody just looked forward to bringing the crowd back and, uh, you know, racing's it. We've been, like I said, involved in some type of form of racing for the last 25 years. So. Matt Myers was born and raised in Wilkesboro and loves all types of racing. So much so, he started a business that allows him to stay connected with his first love. Our main focus is the off-road race community is mainly motorcycles. We do motocross, supercross, um, off-road racing. Just anything pretty much endurance based racing, but we do do vehicle decals. Matt told me he doesn't expect the huge crowds in his hometown to boost business for his store, but he is all fueled up and ready for North Wilkesboro to find itself in the winter circle when it's all said and done. Just like to see people walking around some I mean, this town gets looked over all the time, but it's such a historical place, so just bringing people back, that's, that's good. Reporting in North Wilkesboro, Jalen Gilkey, WFMY News 2. Lots of excitement, a lot of people talking about it. We've been talking about it for weeks now, I so. So I looked it up the other day. The population of North Wilkesboro is less than 5,000. It's like mm. 4,300, something like that, at least with, uh, I think it was a 2010, cent no, 2020 census that I saw. And then it's going to bring 60,000 people in. I mean, just yeah. think how many times That's that multiplies there. It's amazing. I, a lot of money coming into the city, the restaurants, the hotels, <clears throat> all that good and stuff. And you, you drive by by the Speedway for, you know, decades, and yeah. it's just Going to Boone. nothing, Double right? Weed. And then all of a sudden, here we are. And I mean, it, it's just so cool. And, and props to uh, the governor and Dale Earnhardt Jr., <clears throat> who've really helped put this plan into motion. Very nostalgic for a lot of people yeah. in this state.